Another Nike tier list just dropped, updated for February 2024. I'm not going to go over the whole tier list because it's way too big. Right? It's way, way too long. As you can see, this is a long ass tier list. I did, however, to save you the pain of going through this, already highlighted some of the stuff. So I want to show you that and then who these people are because it's funny. Also interesting that this website is called gametierlist.com, but even tier list here on the menu, it's misspelled. It's tier list. Now, I am not English. I will always say the same. It's fine to have grammar errors. It's fine. So, good things about this tier list, right? Let me go here. Let me go here. First, the introduction. In Nike tier list, as in Greek mythology, when it comes to god and goddesses, in Pokemon Go, the players come across many powerful characters, like the legendary Pokemon, which then they try to collect and hold together to form the ultimate team. A good start, a good start, I will say. So again, I'm not going to go over everything, only some of the interesting stuff that I found here. So, starting with Blank. The novice skill, which is extremely potent. What the fuck is the novice skill? I I'm 100% and you'll see this over all of the characters, that they took like the, the pros and cons of each character on Pride One and throw them into ChatGPT, 100%. So, Alice, being a gunner character. Alice is the new gunner in the game for some reason, uh, but it's fine, it's fine, you know. She is changing jobs. We don't mind that since we don't like sniper rifles, it's good that she's becoming a gunner. <laughs> now, how do we know this is AI? Every time you see a little description that says that she heals, you know it's AI. But no, not only she heals, her qualities to recon, respawn, and heal are unique too. Unlike other classes, this is the only one that has an A tier build for any raid group and still runs content at high theoretical efficiency. Great, great, great. Next. Nor. Skill 1 constantly stabilizes the team attack, which is the most agile one during the game. Again, this is 100% taken from God knows where, right? God knows where. And instead of saying that attack buffs are good, they are the most agile in the game, which I don't even know what the fuck that means. <laughs> this whole tier list is written like... It's, it's translated from an either... Arabic or Asian language because it doesn't make makes any sense at all and there's nothing wrong Right if you don't have like the best English, but it, it's obvious AI. It's not like a mistranslation per se. It's just AI Now let's come here. The next one is Scarlet and the only thing I highlighted here is the introduction this thing <laughs> Scarlet introduction. It's this thing is good at doing a lot of damage to the enemy <laughs> What the fuck is this thing put my girl? It's just called this thing, this fucking object right here, right? right? Look at this guy's doing my girl dirty. Next, Salmon Alex. A skill one has a mighty effect on the whole community. That belly is so good. It affects the whole community. And I hopeful, I 100% agree. It's so good. It affects the whole community. Look at that. And tell me it doesn't. Look at that. Now we have some competition with Alex, but still, she's the best one. <laughs> she is the best one, right? Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Chill. Like this. A2. DPS unit resides is a great option when the boss has sections of it. Fuck. Now, once again, this is taken probably from Predwen or God knows where from the pros and cons. And they took that she's a good DPS unit for both parts and, and QTE, right? And said, cool, whatever. <laughs> and they were like, mm, you know what? <laughs> this is probably a good translation by ChatGPT. Let's just put this here. Amazing, amazing. Let's keep going into the next one. We have three more. Don't worry. 2B. They have great HP, health points, and can take down the wall easily with enhanced attack. Values and pressure attacks. 2B, it's so good. Her booty has so much pressure that she will take the 160 wall on her own. Just by per pressure. Which is fine. <laughs> we can stand behind that, right? Then second part in here. 
To be competitive, massive investment is involved in hardware production and the development of software that fits the hardware. <laughs> now, you may be thinking, well, Sefi, she's technically a robot, right? So you're making the hardware. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know about the one, but we'll, we'll, we'll keep it there. We'll keep it there. <laughs> and we have one more, I believe, which is here. Yes, Drake. After the introduction, which we don't care, they say, listen to the given audio and summarize the key ideas in your own words. Once again, further proof that this is either AI, someone trolling, or just bullshit that they don't even know what they're talking about. Now, who are these people? Who are these people? Because that's also quite fun. That's also quite fun. Again, GameTierList.com, we don't really care about that. Sadly, the domain is uh, protected. Nowadays, by default, it's turned on that you have like uh, free security on your name on who is on the website. So you can't really know who owns the website and it's a legal procedure. Uh, but we can go to their about us. <laughs> and they say they are uh, Christopher Robinson, Daniel White, and Brian Thompson. Now, that's cap. That's cap. <laughs> that is the biggest cap I've seen. But let's keep going now. Let's keep going now. Right, right. And we have meet our staff. Yasir Askar, CEO. Maybe this is the real name. I don't know if it's going to be his real picture or not. Maybe it's also fake. But let's go to the writers. Because we have Brian Thompson. Look at Brian with a VR headset. He's playing in 2014. He's ahead of its times. You have Christopher Robinson, game researcher. <laughs> he is, you know, he is tired. He is tired because he's writing a lot of tier lists. <laughs> he is tired. And then you have Joseph Miller playing once again with VR and his twin from another mom, Joseph Miller too, right? A blogger. And you have both Joseph Miller. They are twins. Amazing tier list. As usual, as usual, we keep finding Good stuff. Now, my issue with this with this content, my issue with this content, I don't mind if you just want to make money, right? Uh, and we've seen this in Twitch even. Uh, most, probably it's live right now. Um, is Oli live? Yes, he is live. He is live. So we have the best example here, Oli. Oli8520. This is a bot. I added him on Discord because he sells promotions. I don't know how the fuck that works. He's a Chinese friend. <laughs> He basically streams 16 hours. Well, he, he's been up for 27 hours, okay? 27 hours. This, for most people, is not as bad. It still hurts. But if you are someone who wants to watch Nick content, you will come here, you will see this bullshit, and you will leave because you know it's a bot, right? So you will go to someone else in the Nick category. You will go probably to the best Nick streamer, which is right here, Sefi underscore 922. Go follow me. <laughs> but in the case of websites, it's different because... If you don't know anything about the game, you don't know anything about Nikki, and you watch one of these shit tier lists that a lot of pages has, like GameLib, like uh, GameSkit, or whatever the fuck they were called, or this website, uh, you will actually, you know, hurt your account. And that's a pain in the ass. I do understand you want to make some um, quick money off, 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 off AdSense, which you need a lot of traffic nowadays to make money with AdSense, but still, it's just stupid, though. I, I wish... We could just take down things like this. Of course, these people never answer, uh, never get back to you. Uh, if you send them an email or something on Twitter, they will ignore you. All tell you is not AI. Uh, but yeah, um, guys of victory, you know, <laughs> a tier list for the game based on Greek mythology. <laughs> also in Pokemon for some reason. <laughs> just wanted to showcase this one. And you guys can say goodbye since this was going to be most likely a video for YouTube. Yakutatatsu